Hello, how to solve for x and y in this equation, x plus y is equal to 30, x, y is equal to 45. Solution. x plus y is equal to 30, let's call this equation 1. x, y is equal to 45, let's call this equation 2. Then from equation 1, x plus y is equal to 30 y is equal to 30 minus s let's call this equation 3 then from equation 2 you can substitute for y here that is s y is equal to 45 then when y is equal to 30 minus x, we have x bracket 30 minus s is equal to 45. Then let's open the bracket. S multiplied by 30. This is 30x minus s multiplied by x. This is s square is equal to 45. Then here we have 30x minus x square minus 45 is equal to 0. Then let's put this in standard form. We have minus x square plus 30x minus 45 is equal to 0. Let's divide all through by minus 1. Minus s squared divided by minus 1. This is s squared. Plus 30x divided by minus 1. This is minus 30x. And minus 45 divided by minus 1. This is plus 45. Is equal to 0. And of course, this is a quadratic equation which can be solved using quadratic general formula. s is equal to minus b plus or minus square root of b square minus 4ac divided by 2a and from this equation a is equal to 1 b equal to minus 30 c equal to 45 then s is equal to minus bracket minus 30 plus or minus square root of minus 30 square minus 4 multiplied by a is 1 multiplied by c is 45 divided by 2 multiplied by a is 1 or we have discriminant is equal to b square minus 4 a c then d is equal to minus 30 square minus 4 multiplied by a is 1 multiplied by 45 then d is equal to minus 30 square that is 900 minus 4 multiplied by 1 multiplied by 45 then this is 180 Then D is equal to 900 minus 180. This is 720. Now, S is equal to 30 plus or minus square root of 720 divided by 2. But square root of 720 is equal to square root of 144 multiplied by 5 then here we have x is equal to 30 plus or minus square root of 144 multiplied by 5 divided by 2 s is equal to 
30 plus or minus square root of 144, that is 12, then root 5 over 2. Then S is equal to 30 divided by 2 plus or minus 12 root 5 divided by 2. 2 year 1, 2 year 15. 2 year 1, 2 year 6. S is equal to 15 plus or minus 6 root 5. Therefore, S1 is equal to 15 plus 6 root 5. And then S2 is equal to 15 minus c is root 5. So these are the value of s1 and s2. Now to solve for y1 and y2, from equation 3, y is equal to 30 minus x y1 is equal to 30 minus s1 is 15 plus 6 root 5 then y1 is equal to 30 minus 15 minus times plus this is minus 6 root 5 then y1 is equal to 30 minus 15. This is 15 minus 6 root 5. Also for y2, y2 is equal to 30 minus s2. y2 is equal to 30 minus 15 minus 6 root 5 y2 is equal to 15 plus 6 root 5. This is the value of y2. We can check to confirm. Therefore, therefore, s1 comma y1 is equal to 15 plus 6 root 5 comma 15 minus 6 root 5 then s2 comma y2 is equal to 15 minus 6 root 5 comma 15 plus 6 root 5. We can see that S1 here is equal to Y2 here and then Y1 here is equal to S2 here. We can check to confirm if this answer is right or wrong. Let's check. To check, we have S plus Y equal to 30 s y equal to 45 let's consider this s plus y this is 15 plus 6 root 5 plus 15 minus 6 root 5 must be equal to 30 this will cancel this we have 15 plus 15 must be equal to 30. Then 50 plus 50, this is 30, is equal to 30, which is true. Now let's consider this. We have SY is equal to 45. Then this is 15 plus 6 root 5 bracket. 15 minus 6 root 5 must be equal to 
45 50 times 15 this is 225 19 root 5 then 6 root 5 multiply by 50 this is plus 90 root 5 then this is 6 root 5 multiply by minus 6 root 5 this is minus 36 multiply by 5 must be equal to 45 this will cancel this we have 2 to 5 minus 36 multiplied by 5 this is 180 must be equal to 45 then if you subtract 180 from 2 to 5 this is 45 is equal to 45 which is true i hope you enjoyed the video thank you for watching please don't forget to like share comment and subscribe to my channel bye